Hello, my lovely Sagittarius. How are you guys? I hope everybody's well. Sagittarius, today we'll do a bonus reading from the time you view this video till September 15. As you know, general readings might resonate with you, might not, so take the message best suited for you. Also, many thanks for each of you who join my channel. Subscribe, like, share, comment. Many, many, many thanks. Also, for those who purchase a reading from me. Sagis, as you know, I run a $30 discount for each reading you do as we speak right now, going till the end of September. And that's including those readings who are delivered between 3 days and 10 days. Also, Sagis, you need to understand that this personal readings I do are for the new people, also for those of you who book this time frame, okay? Because I have a lot of questions from you guys, when it's coming, how it's coming, so I feel I need to clarify that. Also, feel free to email me with any question. I'm here for you to answer because I'm here to help you guys. But let's see here what we got over this time frame and how the energy plays for you, my loves, and whatever comes. All right, let's see here what we got for you, Sagis. We have Page of Swords. Some information coming towards you. Somebody might look towards what my Sag is doing or what the Sagittarius is doing. You might look towards somebody else here. Overall energy is telling me your interest, your person of your interest might look towards you, might search information about you or you might search information about them. In this case... I definitely see somebody want to talk to you. Also, you need to know more about why they want to talk to you. You are very curious, very curious energy here. And yes, somebody is like very concerned why you're not talking to them. You might block them or you might not want to open up to them or whatever was the situation here. Somebody feels very concerned why you do what you do. But let's see here. Who is this person and what they want? Queen of Wands, Seven of Cups, World, Justice, Star, Queen of Cups, Ace of Cups, Eight of Swords, and Ace of Wands. And what's coming towards you? All right. So, Sagittarius, if you are dealing with the water sign, we have a Cancer here. Cancer Scorpio Pisces might be that person or could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or they channel that energy. For whatever reason, Sagis, you've been very confused regarding this person. Very confused, like emotionally imbalanced, or they could be emotional balance. But I definitely see here a uh, ending between you two. Also, this person feels is not fair what happened between you two. They also once come back. And also, I feel this person is not moved on from you. If you feel Sagis, I'm moved on, I'm out, I'm about, this person, it is not moved on. They definitely crave, wants a new beginning. There's still a lot of passion here, a lot of love. And they feel like they, one of you, I'm not saying that you or them, one of you, feel very stuck, also feel something not fair happened this. For some of you Sagittarius, you might feel like I have other people or I, I need to keep my options open. You, you didn't feel like this is the one for you as 
this person thought for for you, my loves. But I feel here was a lot of misunderstanding between you and this person. What I'm feeling here, this is Aquarian energy, could happen some communication around new moon in uh, Aquarius, which happened in um, August, as we speak, or could happen in a very short time. And this is this summer happening, okay? Or by starting September. I definitely see here one of you might travel to see the other one. Somebody wants to see you or you want to see them. Because here needs to be balance between you two. Also, what I'm feeling here, it is not that I need the balance. is I want to be fair towards you. Okay. Also, what I'm feeling, this person is somebody who has been very serious towards you. They could channel this energy. But let us say they are the person who got in love with you, the way you are, the way you, like, good, bad you are. It's not like, I like my Sagis or I love my Sagis just because they're awesome or they have this and that. No. They like you the way you are. Exactly the way you look, even you are at nighttime, if you are at daytime, if you are at a party. They still not get over you and they still want some sort of new beginning. So, Sagis, this Cancerian energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, they want something stable. They might shoot you a message, a text here anytime soon. They would like something, you know, very flirty message might tell you, hey, can we have a coffee? Or I didn't see you for a long time. How you've been? So expect something from this person. And truly, through that message, this person want to tell you, actually, I missed you and I didn't move on from you. Because truly, they want this back. They want the love you give them or vice versa and the passion. So, Sagis, expect that from this person. For many of you, you might consider it is over between the two, but I don't feel that it is over. At least some communication is happening. For many of you, it is happening and will happen in a very short time. And most likely after the, the new moon in Aquarius. But let's see here. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Why the Seven of Cups? Why the Sagis is keeping the options open? You could keep the options open. Or you might had miss... Like you might feel like this person didn't show you exactly what they want from you. You've been very confused what they want from you. Some of you might feel that way. That hurt you. Whatever option, whatever options over there hurt. Or whatever miscommunication. Somebody could not share their emotions or didn't feel love the way it is or feel like you didn't give them everything or vice versa. Somebody didn't give it all to this connection. Somebody might not communicate clearly what they want. Why the world happened here? Somebody wants their independency, which most likely it's you, Sag. You might feel this person say something, it's it's just like saying and not doing it. And you decide to, to clear the air and end this relationship. For some of you, Sagis, you feel like I'm better on my own. So let's wrap it up. Even hurts. I, I think I'm better on my own. Why this person desires to come back? Why this Aquarian energy here? Why this star is here? temperance this person really wants peace in their life they feel this relationship absolutely was 
not a fair share they want to make peace also they are healing star and temperance is healing also temperance is a reconciliation this person wants you back they want to come back they want to make it right for both of you because they felt like was something not as opposed to was not a fair share or they feel it's kind of you both felt like you I give more oh no I give more for some of you might be somebody involved here or being other people involved even could be a money situation one of you could make more money than the other one why this person could not move on from the Sag? Why this person could not move on from the Sag? Because they still love you. Sag, this person you are thinking or you are connected, they couldn't move on from you because they love you. And they want to clear the air for, from you. Might not be communication or my unexisted communication. They want to communicate with you. They love you. They absolutely adore you. They feel left out in a call from you. They feel like you left and you didn't even care about them. One more card. But they want you back. This is another reconciliation card. Celebration card. Stability card. This person was serious. Even you thought... They give you mixed emotions or mixed stuff or you thought it was a third party. As you thought they have a third party, they thought you have a third party, which neither of you had none, okay? So some communication, it is coming here. This person is not moved on from you. So let me make it clear here. Let's see here why this stalking energy here for some of you might be kids involved or kids could be um, a big thing or the third party could be kids but let's see here why this page of swords why this page of swords somebody's waiting for communication absolutely let's see here somebody is overthinking here for some reason will I get any communication from you or not after this ending somebody felt like this end in a very harsh way or ended the way supposed to not they are not okay with this ending yeah and here's the Virgo energy but it is kind of this this person feels like you abandon them somebody feel abandoned but still in a wait situation because they cannot move on. They cannot move on unless it is the clearest energy here. They feel this was unfair. They want absolutely a new beginning. They want the nurture back. Again, Virgo energy. They want to make things right with you. They want a new beginning with you. We have all the aces here. It's kind of like what, whatever old ways happened between you two, now they want to clear the air. Let's see here. One more card. Yes, they, they are coming here. They, they might literally move closer to you or could be a move in together in a very short time to start something new. You might be very confused what they are want from you, but I feel here the confusion will be clear out with this Ace of Swords. So, yeah, Sagis, let's see here some messages from this person you are dealing. We have here a Virgo, we have a Libra, a Quarian, and Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Let's see here some messages from this person you are dealing, Sagis. They want to reconcile with you, judgment. Definitely I feel here this person feels like I have unfinished business with my Sagis. I'm not okay. How did it end? Or how this turn around? 
one more card. They want a way, like if before started unstable, they want something stable now. They want you back. And yes, this is somebody you've been dealing, Sag, in another past life. Somebody who is very intuitive. Somebody who is guided by their intuition. You might be the one. One more card here. What this person wants. Yeah, they want you back, Sagis. They want to reconcile with you. They still have a lot of passion for for you, Sagittarius. Yes. Let's see here what you, Sagittarius, should do. What's your actions towards this person? You also want them back. You are very creative at this time. And of course, you are very going forward very energetic, very like driven whatever you do and you feel like yes this could work very high vibrational king of wands but at the same time you you might feel like I I need to be very cautious even I want this person I need to be more like reserved you are very reserved in what you do, but you do everything what you do right now. It is right what you do. Sometimes you are overly thinking things and not doing them. But King of Wands with Nine of Wands says like, go ahead. Cautiously go ahead. One more card. Some decision will be made will be made and that will be Sagis in a very short time this person is clear they want to reconcile with you they want you back they want fairness and whatever will be here the decision is on your court the ball is on your court you are in the driver's seat they will come ahead they will text you but it shows me like you are more cautious now. If back then when you've been with them, you've been like very like light. Now you, if you've been a knight in the past with this person, like very easy going, go ahead. Now you know what you want. And you a little more like, should I say this? Should I not? Should I make this decision or not? You will make. The decision you are make will go forward. Either you will end, either you will start. But the, the ball is in your course edge. Absolutely. Because you are thinking right now. Also, you see the situation with this person differently. Also, for many of you, the hangman, you feel like, I need sometimes to think. Do we work together or not? Because if you make this decision, very fast movement will happen into your life as this person will go ahead fast movement. And of course, fast movement, it is happening in a very short time. So, yes, yeah, Sagis. Yes, yeah, Sagis, the decision is on you, my loves. Let's see here an outcome card. One more card for the Sagis. Whatever message is there. Six of Wands. Overcoming whatever was in the past. Putting the past behind and moving forward. Absolutely. So, my loves... I definitely see here a very good outcome between you and this person. Congratulations, Sagittarius. Also, I'm feeling here for many of you who you thought maybe this is not the right for me, right now, making the decision that for yourself, you will see such a good uphill going forward and moving forward with this person. 
also for many of you a lot of people might look towards you and say like you are insane somebody is saying that but you know this insanity will lead you to success and also this relationship will go into success so yes my loves this is what I got for you and here you are lovely 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 all right Sagis thank you for watching many blessings to all of you and we'll see you later on bye for now